shit right now, I wonder what happened. Nah, for real, I piss niggas off. You know you ain't raw, just quit out of rapping. Yeah, yeah, bitches KO. Now niggas out with the floor, my dogs be trapping. Bet I put the whole gang on the map in. Fuck a whore, I'm a kind of a back end. From behind, no one pushing the back end. Bad bitches, I track them. Hey man, say man, it's your boy Sage Season TV man. Back with another video. Now it looks like Young Chop has been arrested again. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I said again for the second time this month on Thursday, April sixteenth. Now the first time he got arrested was for reckless conduct. That's all from all from uh, the police. You know, right now and all the stuff he's been doing on social media, they charged him with reckless conduct. Now <clears throat> it looks like. He is back in jail for a probation violation. Now, according to the Cornette County Police Report uh, records, Chop was booked around uh, 3.30 p.m. Thursday for a probation violation. The record shows that he was not given a bond. It remains behind bars. He was originally placed on probation after being arrested on an aggravated cruelty to animals charge in an incident where he was accused of starving his dog to death. Back in February, tw back on February 26th. As you see, this is this new mug shot right here, ladies and gentlemen. Boy, I tell you, Young Chop is one wild nigga. Do not know how to chill out. Do not know how to calm. Do not know how to calm down, man. This coronavirus fucking up a lot of shit. Niggas is taking it to levels that they don't have to take it, man. Now. I don't have no ill will towards Young Chop. He never done nothing to me in any way. But I can't say I really feel bad for Young Chop because he knows exactly what he's doing. And you know what they say about energy? What you put out comes back to you, in my opinion. And necessarily, it don't have to mean just death, especially with all the beefs that he's been starting, the stuff he did, like going to 21 Savage's hood, trying to pull up, you know, trying to uh, uh, press people or whatever. You could end up in jail based on whatever energy you put out. Look at Kodak with the whole uh, Lauren London situation after Nip Nipsey died. He didn't end up getting killed or pressed by no cap no dudes in Cali. He ended up going to jail over something real, real stupid where he's missing out on four years. Now, I do hope for the best for Young Chop as far as his mental state. Because I don't think he's really well. For him doing what he's doing, he's really trying. He looks like he really won't be satisfied until someone gets hurt or, or he or he gets harmed himself. Now, I know he's grieving the loss of his mother, grandmother, and uncle. But this is not the way to go about, you know, when you're grieving through stuff. I know people handle stuff differently. But, you know, start, you know, going at people and beefing all that online, doing all that reckless shit, shooting at folks from, you know outside your front porch that ain't it chief that ain't it chief you know what i'm saying but yeah i will keep y'all updated as the store as stuff progresses of will he uh will he get out will he get prison time whatever whatever's gonna happen i'll keep y'all updated tell what y'all think about in the comment section hit the like button subscribe share and comment for more videos hit the bell so you can be notified when i upload new video and as always thank you for tuning in to sad season tv man i'm out to talk my shit right now, I wonder what happened. Nah, for real, I piss niggas off. You know you ain't raw, just quit out of rapping. Yeah, yeah, bitches KO. Now niggas out with the floor, my dogs be trapping. Bet I put the whole gang on the map in. Fuck a whore, I'm a kind of a back end. From behind, no, I'm pushing the back end. Bad bitches, I track them. Rolling around this black.